Yellow spinners, you're on Pen's talk channel about pen spinning. My name is Alex Lanz and today I will show you how to do extended infinity. Yeah, I know you've been asking for tutorial for this trick for years. And as a little compensative bonus, I will also show you how to master double and triple extended infinity tricks. Concept is kind of the same as double infinity. Single extended infinity can be mastered with a simple pen, take it by its grip in T1 vertically and sway hand down to let pen fall. While it's falling, move two under it to stop pen's movement and uh, fix pen in one two. The beginning is very similar to non extended infinity and now, now you will see the difference between those two tricks. Because instead of raising the pen and letting it fall back, you raise it and make gripped charge in one two just like that. After that, after the full circle in one two, you let pen fall down and uh, move thumb under it to pinch it in D1. A little hint for learning, pay attention on how I move hand. First I sway it palm side to let pen go fall down. When it's in 1-2 I turn hand palm down and sway it horizontally to the left. At the same time I straighten fingers and a little bit raise them. When the grip is again in T1 I make this circular motion and turn hand palm side with this circular movement. But those swains of course are just for learning, they look too immature. Because you know, less you move your hand, better your spin looks. And easier it is to stay in frame while you're filming your spin to send it to a girl you find on Tinder. Practice this gripped charge in 1-2 to be able to make at least two revolutions in order to be confident in making one. That's how it always works in pen spinning. You see how middle finger acts up and down and also how the eyes straighten and curve them back? That's what you should keep in mind as an end goal of mastering the trick. Also you have to have enough space between 1 and 2 in order to let pen tip go easily between them. For that you can curve 1 as though you are pressing it on a straightened middle finger. Or you can curve middle finger and leave one straightened. That will be also okay. You like lead pen by curving middle finger. Or you can also curve both fingers and make gap between them by holding pen with fingers tips. So many possibilities. Try each way and find out which one works for you better and let us know in comment section below. It will be interesting to find out ratio. They are all legit and will help you to learn other wiper tricks as well. After you mastered extended infinity and can do it without a pause between wiper and charge when it looks like a solid movement even with those swains. At this point you can also already add another motion to make double extended infinity. Yeah at this point I will definitely recommend you using double capped or single capped pen mod, properly made pen mod, which you can get from penstock.net shop for pen spinners with the delivery all over the world. While you're waiting for it to arrive you can make a big tree mod using my tutorial video, otherwise you would probably spend much more time on double extended that infinity than it really needs. Okay, we complete trick up to a point when you do charge, gripped charge in 1-2, then wiper, pen falls down, but instead of moving thumb under it, you move three under it. Ring finger stops pen and it stops in this position between these three fingers. Look how hand moves from palm down to palm side in order to make pen fall in 2-3. Uh, now again, I turn hand palm down and make another charge now in 2-3, just the same as previous one. Let pen move in 2-3, slightly erase them, so pen would fall on 2 and will stop in this position. Again between these three fingers, but this time most of weight will be from this side. At this point you can already move 3 away and make another charge in 1-2. The rest is completely the same as in the first step. We do wiper and uh, finish the trick. To show you how to master triple extended infinity I will already start from doing charge in 2-3, though for me it was easier to learn for starting from the very beginning, probably to keep on momentum. And the concept is completely the same as on previous step. After doing charge in 2-3 we make this wiper and the stop pen in 3-4. Now, charging 3-4 is bad, <laughs> it is really bad. Spinners, gather all patience you've got to master it and focus on the main end goal. You can close your eyes and remember that video about how to develop your pinky finger or how to make finger exercises. Links to those videos you will find in the description under this video. Pull yourself together and let pen go under 3 in 2-3, three, then charge in this slot and so on till the end of the trick. Psych! This trick doesn't have an end, it lives up to its name, infinity. You can do it forever, and each time you will get better and better. 